What's up, Ghana, Africa, to the world? Thank you for an official speaking. This is another episode of Good Vibe Show. And on this episode, we are here with a Tamali guy, Komo Tamali Kande Vota region. We will talk about him and his music and whatever about him. So keep a look here, subscribe to the post notification bell and be notified anytime we drop a video. We'll be right back. <music> Welcome back. We have Don KC here. What's up? Charlie. Everything good. Everything good. What would be the meaning of Don KC? Yeah, actually, Don KC. You know, Don, Don, Don. That time we, mm -hmm. uh, everything calmed down like that. As for KC, I, I took the inspiration from this Nigerian uh, artist. I don't know if you've heard of him, KC. He recently dropped, uh, is it Ama Piano? That is trending on social media like that. Yeah, so way back when I started this uh, whole thing, uh, I was inspired by him. I used to love his vocal. Mm. You know uh -huh. So I, I picked the letters of his name and then I added the don just to show the difference. Yeah. Okay, so you are from uh, uh, Tamale, which is Northern region, right? Yes, yes, sir. And you are now in Volta region? Yes, sir. As a teacher? Yes, I'm that's a your pro profession. I'm a professional prof teacher. Yeah. Okay, now you from that side of the, the country okay. to this side, do you, you you get what I mean? You are from Northern. You are now in Volta region. Yeah, man. Comparing these two places, how has music business treat you? Comparing that place and here. Okay, so uh, mm. I I I go free talk say mm. where I come from. You know, the the supports be different from a. Uh, uh, Actually, I, I go different places. Before I come to Volta region, I travel. I mm. travel before, yeah. So back uh, at the north, the support is there. Mm. Yeah, man. You, you can testify when uh, these our northern guys are having competitions with uh, people on this media, uh, this uh, TV treatment. Uh, yeah, yeah. You see the support our people give. Yeah. So music back there, uh, I would say that uh, our people are really supporting. And then, uh, if I relate the uh, support back to uh, this one, I would say that uh, it has actually moved me to a level. Uh, you see, human beings, they, if they plus them, that respects no day like if you mm. come on them about this more. Uh, mm. So, as I come, the voter, the MCC, where my production self can't change. Mm. Uh, it can't change. For I can't miss my baddest, my baddest, youngest. Producer crash the beats, law life in Keta here, and then uh, my people are enjoying the productions. Uh, so the level, I would say that it has uh, eliminated small. There, there is this conversation on social media and this perception that uh, other regions don't really shine. Other really regions, creatives, mid talents don't really shine as compared to people in the Greater Accra region. Yeah, man. So yeah, man. we have the likes of Adam. Which has made it to the to the limelight from Volta from region. Volta. We have the likes of Wiala, uh, Fancy Gardan from the northern. We have uh, Kinata and from uh, Tadi and all these places. Yeah, man. Yeah, man. Would you say it's a fact that when you are in the Greater Accra region, you can't make it to the limelight? Yes. Yeah, so um, I won't say that. It all depends on your hard work. Okay. Yes, but I, 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 I would say that he's having a connection this way. You see my godfather, Fancy Gadam, you mentioned. He's, he's our godfather, like our senior man from the Tamali. And then uh, before Fancy Gadam came to like this limelight like this, he had to feature uh, uh, Sarkodie. Sarkodie okay. is a greater crap based artist, you understand? Yeah, so I would say that he's having influence, but it also depends on your hard work. Okay. Uh, I don't see you not staying in greater across a barrier or something once you are talented you put in your good works and the hard work sure sure, sure you sure. just need an influential person like who is over there who is having the numbers mm -hmm. put him on one of your songs then then that is it you, you, okay um let's talk about how you use your la your language in your in your music you realize the case you are from somewhere you are not in voter region yeah. creating or having different audience to yourself yeah. right and yeah we don't understand we voterians we don't really understand the your language, language. Okay. so 
how, how do you feel when you put content out there and people do you get feedbacks like oh charlie this language i don't understand this kind of vibe you get that kind of feedback uh, yeah like it happens but you know music is something when it sounds good mm. you enjoy it like that music is for the soul you know so people that listen to good music people that understand music know what i'm talking about language is not a barrier when I came here, I dropped songs like Mbama. Mbama is fully, like, purely in my northern language. Mm. A lot of guys in the Volta region are vibing to it mm. because of the reading, because of the rhyme. So, language is not a barrier. When you make the music hit the soul, like, it consoles somebody. That is it. Although I get those feedbacks, Charlie, the song is nice, but I know they understand. Yeah, so because of that, when I came into this market, I tried to reach some of these voter artists. Yeah, so that, uh, you know, sometimes if you want to uh, put a message across to people that do not understand the language you speak, you know, you would surely need an interpreter. Uh -huh. So I try to link up with some of these uh, big guys around, Green Boss, Bacteria. So if I put a Volta guy on my song, what um, the message I'm trying to put across, I explain it to the person. So the person puts a verse of that message in the language for the people to also understand. Yeah, so that is how we run it over okay. It's still Hood Vibe Show. I'm here with Don Casey and keep it locked here. We'll be back soon. Welcome back. I'm Enke Van Ofisha, your regular host in this Hood Vibe show. So now, let's talk about um, your music. Yeah, man. You are here with a new music. What's the title? Yes, so my, my latest is a You Alone. Mm -hmm. Alone, I featured a Vimbo's Baxia on it. Okay. I was one. Okay, so what, what inspired that particular kind of vibe? Yeah, so, uh, you know, if, if you find yourself in a new environment, you you look at and then uh, study what the people over there like and would accept yeah so when i came around i tried to make some you know underground things Charlie, your people wish like music do they really understand and love to vibe these yeah, people so, these people know be my people oh no 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 not you like during my investigation okay. then uh -huh. so then yeah. so Charlie, the guys you know guys guys them they love this raga raga dance all thing mm. me i be afro pop afro beats artist you understand okay. yeah so i i decided to do this one afro dance all mm. with a uh, back so i needed somebody bad too yeah so say we go feel accompany the lyrics then the people go accept them and uh, the song is making waves song is making waves so actually this one was to uh, uh, to make the people of the Volta region discover me okay. yeah so that inspired me I wanted to do music that will let the people discover the new talents that has come around okay yeah. so has done uh, has that particular song done that to you oh yeah man yeah man yeah okay. man it did it did uh, because of this song I got nominations into the just ended the Volta Music and Entertainment Awards. Oh, okay. I went for some radio talk shows uh, at uh, Sun, City. Sun City Radio, Jubilee Radio, and then uh, I did. Uh, I played some couple of shows because of that particular songs. How how does uh, your music or your musical career have influence in your profession as a teacher? Yeah, man. And so vice versa. yeah, so I would say that you know teaching profession is uh, an everyday thing yeah man. so you spend the whole day in school and then you close late in the evening so uh, that time that you would need to focus on writing your lyrics and vibes uh, is, is not there like that uh -huh. so I would say that it's just a time but if you are smart you know you are you are talented time shouldn't be a factor like that I, I and i am I'm, I'm even learning like from the teaching profession i discover a whole lot of things that are giving me messages to you know okay. put it in songs for the people to vibe with yeah okay so vice versa how does your music affect like you teaching in class do you use any of your creative skills to teach the students to get oh yeah man, yeah man music is fun you know yeah. <laughs> music is fun yes uh, you know putting happiness in people yeah so when i get to class how i vibe you know how you even talk 
can put somebody's attention like draw somebody's attention to the message you are trying to put across okay. uh, so when you enter class how you deliver how you you know how you vibe with the students uh-huh you make them feel at like, home oh, you sing the musical vibe you know uh-huh so charlie they help me they help me a lot they help yeah, you a man. lot how how how, how? Is um, your new song doing on, on the streaming sites? Yes, yeah, so uh, we are trying to put it out there on uh, all the streaming platforms. But f- uh, for now, we have it on YouTube and then uh, Audio Mark. The numbers are encouraging. The numbers are increasing every day. Every day. Yeah, man. Audio Mark, what and is then, the stream so far? Yeah, I, I think uh, the song is not up to a week okay. or so. Mm-hmm. Yeah, so Audio Mark, we have like. Uh, 500 plus streams then the youtube also 500 and so in total we 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 will be having like 1k in a week yes and uh, very soon it will be out on all the social media uh, streaming platforms yes yes i think we'll do two more questions then we go and this is it um your music um the questions have been like lost at the count Okay, so so your music, as a as a creative, right? Yeah. Five years from now, or what is what, five years from now? How where do you see your your, your music? Five years too far, give it. Okay, uh, how, it's too your, far, give it. Your, your, yourself, how many? <laughs> no, yourself, how many years? Five years too far, give it. So like in the next two years, yeah. two years, I should be somewhere. You know the people, the people have accepted me. Like from where I come from, the energy as my. But when you watch uh, some of these programs that I go with my squad back at the north, you know that nah, this guy is already established. Mm. Initially, I said that this is a new environment for me. Yeah. So once the people from this side accept me, from and I know they've already done that from the streaming numbers, like the the fan base I'm gathering one 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 like that. I know. You know, go read two years like that. Say. You know, go read two yeah, years. Yeah, I did like tell you. I did tell you. You go make, you go make, you know, go read two years. You go we make go do the big screens, then the billboards, then things, Charlie. Yeah, yeah man. Right. So, yeah. in case that happens, will you leave your profession? Profession. You know, it's about uh, making yourself comfortable, uh, you know. Uh, being able to support life, yeah, being the guy, able to. The guy they leave the teaching. Of <laughs> that will be the issue. The, the whole the... the whole thing is about you know, uh, you being able to uh, take care of mama, papa, mm. and, uh, you know, so, so make far. some impacts. Mm. Yeah. So if the fame come, with the, the music the, the, do the, that the, job. Uh, with the do come, mm. yeah, man, yeah. Man. I for know they do the chalk based on. <laughs> What, what, what do you make of what do you make of the president saying teachers cannot become billionaires or whatever billionaires or whatever? Okay, so uh, of late I would say that teaching profession is not bad though. Uh, all is uh, all depends on you okay. as the individual. Yes, how you manage your finance and uh, all that. So he's saying that teachers cannot make it like with what they get from the, the teaching profession i i wouldn't say that maybe he's speaking that uh, he made that statement from maybe some experiences that so i wouldn't say he's wrong but i would say that for someone to be successful it depends on the person uh, so me as a teacher can prosper or can become somebody depending on how i choose to live Jesus. and manage myself yeah man. okay let's wrap up yeah man. Your last words to your fans and people there. Yeah, man, yeah, man. So I, I just want to say that just as I mentioned earlier, mm-hmm. uh, I want the support to keep coming. You know, it be it be you people where they keep me where I can't reach this side. Yeah. So no respect for yourself. Uh, hood vibes. And then no respect. My baddest producer crash the beat floor. How you they talk? They think they record. <laughs> so, continue. I, I won't get you continue. Uh, mm-hmm. so yeah so enough respect to my baddest producer sound the beast law yeah all the guys around my senior one being boss bacteria and then my senior men at home you know how we do it <laughs> I think we'll get some people from northern region view this so if you are new and you are from northern region 
Good vibes show go touch up that place one day definitely. So yeah, man. I you wait. just have to subscribe. I say if you go north, you know go come. You know go come here. I mean, I know one, I know one miss anywhere <laughs> my hope. So I know say if I go anywhere, I go go. I go, go. <laughs> I, I, personally, I'm in the process of finding home, right? I don't okay. feel any so I yeah, will but, still go yeah, anywhere. But, but north is home, you know. North, North is, home. is home. If you are to home, you, right? you know how you feel. No, no, no. Like, North is home. That's a statement. So, wherever you come, or where you go now, mm. it will turn like it be your home. Charlie, this way will allow you to go now. <laughs> this has been another episode. I'll see your regular host. Thank you, Van Official. Peace out.